All right, guys, welcome back. This is gonna be another race day vlog. Today, I'm gonna be changing oil in the race car. I'm gonna show y'all what kind of tools we use and what all you gotta do to change it. Only tools you're gonna need to change is you're gonna need a flat head. For this old pan, you're gonna need a three quarter wrench. You're gonna have to have a oil filter wrench and then an oil pan to drain it. First thing we're gonna do right here, we're gonna crank it up and let the oil get hot. And after that, we're gonna drain it. got soaking wet we're gonna jack this thing up get it on jack stand and start draining the oil So now what we're gonna be doing is we gotta loosen up this bolt right here on the oil pan. It's a three quarter bolt, just loosen it, drain the oil out of it. Then I got a wick filter right here. I don't know if you can see it or not. This wick filter right here. You gotta take it off with a, you gotta take it off with a oil filter wrench. Don't forget rags either. Then you're just gonna check the the oil plug has got a magnet on the end of it. Then you're just gonna check it for any kind of debris or any kind of metal on it and make sure that it looks clean. This one looks pretty clean, so we're gonna rock on with it. Then we're gonna just stick this to the bottom of the frame. That way we know where it's at, and while the oil pan is draining, we're gonna take the oil filter off. Make sure you got it over the oil drain. If not, it's gonna go all over the floor. Then all you do is you look up here at where the gasket goes for the for the oil filter. You're gonna check and make sure there's no gasket on there. And wipe it off real good. That way the new one's ready to go on. Once you get it off, I like to fill it all the way up to the top because it'll sink down. Then you get your finger and dab it in the oil and rub it across the rim. That way it'll make a good seal whenever you go to tighten it up. So we'll put just a little bit more in there. Now I'm ready to go back on and tighten up. Now while that's finishing draining a little bit, I'm gonna get the new one tightened back up.
now that most of the oil's out of it, I'm gonna put the plug back in there and tighten it back up. Now I'm gonna just take this breather off right here. Off of the flathead screwdriver or a 5 16 nut driver. this off and that's when I put the oil down. I put it down this breather right here. Now this car, different cars take different things, but this old pan, it holds, uh, holds eight quarts of oil. And we don't run anything but the Delo 1540. The best kind of oil in my opinion that you can get it's got a lot of zinc in it now all you want to do is just put this back on where you had it at so the hood will fit and fire it up I'm gonna do is I'm gonna check my stagger, put more gas in it, uh, go over my cross, get everything back to where it was the week before. I think the car was pretty good. And then we're gonna load it up and take it out to Sayre this Saturday for the, I thought it was gonna be a 50 lap race, but it's actually gonna be a 40 lap race. It's gonna be the King of Dixie. It's gonna be, I think it's a thousand possible to win. We'll see y'all then.